What's going on guys? My name is Drew and today we're gonna be watching me draw a cool alien landscape and I had a lot of fun making this. I did not use a reference which is cool because I always use reference. So you're gonna see me just draw something completely out of my mind and I had an idea of what I wanted this to look like so it's not totally like just wandering but I this is like something I've been wanting to do for a bit so I'm gonna make two more of these and it'll look really cool on my Instagram. They're all gonna connect so Follow me, it's in the description box below. So let's get started now. And by the way, I just wanna say, if you're new to this channel, thanks for being here, I really appreciate you. And uh, I hope you subscribe because it helps me out and I hope you like it. So, this is me just deciding how I want it to look. I did something like the last one I did, I filmed it, but this one's way better just because of how clean I made it and the other one is kind of the intro to this style, so it's whatever. But yeah, I knew I wanted to put a hole there, make it like, like a, like a, uh, like a spring or just like a really deep, like mysterious hole. And right there, it reminded me of like a dragon eye. So I named this piece like Dragon Island, but it's E Y E Land. It's a pun. But uh, <clears throat> here we go, boys. The thing with these is I want to make everything just look same. You know, same kind of same principle with like doing faces, you just wanna make things look very, like to make the shapes well known. Like that's clearly an oval. That's clearly a circle in the middle. And then here I'm just like, that'd be cool to make a bridge. Like, let's just connect it. Cause in my mind I'm like, in a different dimension, land formations probably form different, you know? They probably form in like geometrical shapes. So, I'm just trying to make it look as weird as possible. And something that can help with making your drawings look more interesting is having a big contrast between your light and your dark values. So, for example, the yellow is very bright. And so to give it depth and let people know that there's like a hole, you know, like there's like, well, there's literally a hole, but um, to let people know that there's just, it's like, you could be there. Like, it almost looks like you could just hop in there. And that's really cool. And also, I mentioned I'm gonna make two more uh, of this, like, of this style kind of thing. It's gonna be, to the left of this one, it's gonna be, I'm gonna, I don't even know what it is yet, but I'm just gonna continue it as if it was continued. So if you looked at it, you know, going across like one, two, three on Instagram, it's gonna be like this picture and then I'm gonna upload another one. And then this red just might like, it'll just go into another different color. And I wanna do like the three primary colors. Oh, I tried to do some weird like steps here. I was like, that might look cool. And then I was like, no, that's too like man-made. And so I just smoothed it all out and I don't know. Blending. Blend, blend, blend. Guys, don't forget to blend. It really helps make your drawings look finished and like really realistic. Like my style here, it's like you can tell that it's, you know, I put time into making it look all like blended and shiny and smooth. Um, but it's just a weird world. And you know what, throw your suggestions down. What what kind of creature looking things should I add into the next one? Or like, what kind of landscape should it be? I was thinking of turning it into a mine or something, like not a mine, just like a big cave in the next one. And maybe doing like a, uh, like a, like a cave within a cave, make it a uh, fractal. Cause those look very cool. Especially to us humans, we like those fractals. And so, I added some speckles because 
I wanted it to be clear that it's like a sandy area, like it's like a beach. And I asked people, I'm like, what do you think? And uh, they're like, oh, it looks like, um, looks like a galaxy or the universe. I'm like, no, <laughs> it's a it's a it's a hole with water. Because in this dimension, they have purple water. It's clearly it. And there's the first creature. So I decided to go simple. It's basically a blueberry with a big eyeball, and you'll see that. And right there, it looks like a face. <laughs> and that's another aspect I'm gonna be adding in, is just making things look like faces. Like, you know, just, I might start out with like a general face thing. Like, I made this whole like landscape. It looks, to me, it looks like this red corner in the bottom left corner, or not the red corner, the red line, and then the purple below it, you can't see it now, but that looks like a, uh, like a nose, like a skull, you know how the nose is, and, uh, and so maybe I'll continue the skull mess to it, but I don't know, guys, we'll just have to see. And I always love shading eyes, it's so awesome. It used to be like the hardest thing and now it's like the funnest, more that's the most fun and the easiest. And it's therapeutic just like blending that, making it look so round and stuff. Guys, don't like, the best way to practice is to focus on what you are not best at. <laughs> that sounds pretty obvious but like, we just want to do the things that we're good at because it feels good to do them, but make the things that are hard to you not hard. So then you'll just you'll just become part of the process, like just make it nothing. Because then you can just whip these things out, you know what I'm saying? And I wanted to put rocks in, I'm like, this is a beach in a different dimension. Maybe that's a portal, I don't even know. But you have these gemstone looking rocks near it. I honestly could have spent more time on all of them. This one looks the best, um, but I could have spent more time on the rest of them. You'll see. But I did them pretty fast, I think. So, like, I did them all in like an hour and a half, I think, which is like. It's fast. Because really, you want to blend the shit out of them. Blending is. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna put some dope music behind these videos soon. And it'll be played by me and my friends. So that'll be a shout out. I'm trying to start a band, yo. We got a band. Jobin on SoundCloud, guys, if you want to look us up. You know, I might just put some music on this video, why not? Jobin on SoundCloud. This music is magical though because I almost think it's a bad idea to put it over this video because it really holds your attention without you wanting it to. It's just like, boom, I gotta listen to this, you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that to be like, to like, you know, hype myself up, or, you know, whatever. I'm not saying that to like make myself seem great, even though I am. Just kidding. I'm just saying that because it's true with all jam music. It's just in the moment, you will be too. Guys, don't worry with the audio. I know I've been saying it forever, but I've just been procrastinating. I'm gonna get a great microphone and it'll sound perfect. You guys will just be like, oh, I want to listen to this even more. You know I'm saying, man. Hey, man. Shit. 
Damn, cup. Damn. Damn. It really is hard to talk for uh, 13 minutes straight, but I try my best. Hey, by the way, I'm doing commissions, and I'm gonna make prints of these. So if you want some, I'm gonna link my uh, the website for the prints of these down below, and also my email for my commissions. And if you want to know what that's like, just watch some other videos. I'll link those down below of me doing portrait drawings. And I have a lot of fun doing these, those portrait drawings, but I have even more fun with this because it's pure imagination. And I don't know, I think you guys would like that stuff like this too, you know? So give it a like so I know to keep doing it. I mean, I'm gonna do it anyways, but just give it a like anyways <laughs> because you love your boy. Oh, and I did so much, not so much, but I really did clean everything up. Like these monsters look kind of shaggy right now, but I did make everything look super smooth, including like the whole landscape afterwards. And I didn't record it because I was lazy, but it, the finished picture will be on my Instagram, which is in the description below. So check that out, it's sick. Put some nice highlights on these guys, made them look really wet and shiny. Cause like that's probably what they were supposed to be. Like I don't know if I can draw it, it probably exists, <laughs> you know. But um, I think the video is about to end because I'm signing my name right here just by clicking a button. I kind of miss writing out my name, but it's whatever. It's over. Have a great day. I love you guys, and uh, keep watching. Do all the stuff I said earlier. Bye bye.